finished reading chapter seven and was thinking, wow, that sounds like a dream, being a lifelong learner. Let's get that stack of books and just keep on learning. I forgot to floss my teeth. I don't remember to buy diapers. And there's a subscription that I forgot to cancel. You know, let's just get to the basics and then maybe I'll move on. But I'm gonna tell you some tips that I have used or use currently to help the mommy brain. It's not just for moms, but it's safe for moms, even if you're breastfeeding. What's your favorite fruit? Blueberries. Absolutely. That's why you're so smart, huh? Uh -huh. Cut the process stuff. Get it. Get it. Ginkgo biloba, funny name, great result. Ever hide in the bathroom because everybody's calling your name? Everybody needs something from you and you can't keep it all straight because you have a to-do list? Well, skull cap is for you. That'll straighten out all that chatter. That chatter will be all straightened out. Skull cap is for you. I don't need skull cap. I'm a perfectly well-adjusted human being. I just want to make my brain healthy. All right. Carlson's cod liver oil. Great for brain health. Whoa, there's a baby in the fridge. But in all seriousness, I do take those supplements on occasion to help my brain and diet and exercise plays a big role in my life too to keep my head on straight. Even still, it's no joke being a mom. You're juggling so many different people, so many different schedules, different dreams, different food preferences, different medical histories. You're juggling it all. So we need all the help we can get. Also, this chapter addressed keeping yourself fed mentally and this is really easy for me because we are in an age of information overload where we have so much information at our fingertips. All we have to do is look it up. And so I always love researching new things. I've got a library stack right now that's about 10 books high. I love to read. So it just really is natural for me to always want to feed my brain and as a homeschool mother i can revisit and relearn all the things that i'm teaching my children it's like learning it again and i can go deeper into different things like history and math and things that you know it's been a while so that's a lot of fun too um, yeah, that's about all I have on this subject. I'm really tired. Life has been a little crazy and hectic over here, and I just need to rest my brain. That's the last one, resting. So if you're watching this and it's late at night, <laughs> go rest your brain, okay? I'm gonna go rest my brain. All right, God bless you, bye.